Hello and welcome to Oz Toy Reviews. Now I hope you're stretched and you're feeling all limber because today we're going to be opening up a Ready to Robot Build Swap Battle uh, Mystery Pack and I think it's maybe our fifth one so far. So uh, just to quickly recap, we've got the following guys. We've found uh, Kill Switch, he was first, and then we got uh, Stash second. Kook the third and then back to Stash last time and uh, so that means Stash is going to be the one fighting whoever we have in the new one. So uh, the first battle was between Kill Switch and Kook I think and uh, Kill Switch won and then after that one it was uh, Kill Switch fighting Stash and Stash won so he is going to be the one fighting whoever we have inside this time. So uh, without any more talking, any more jibber jabber, let's open this up. So. First up, we've got to uh, cut along this green line here, but I'll let you check out the pack. I keep forgetting that for some people, it might be your first time seeing one of these open, so um, I'll quickly see you, show you the pack. And this shows you what's inside. So two arms, a cockpit, two weapons, slime, two legs, and a pilot. And the slime is my favorite part, because at the end you kind of shoot it out, and inside you got to dig out the pilot. So uh, we'll cut it open. There are little perforated lines, what you are meant to uh, tear along but it's easier just to cut. Well, it's faster. If I wasn't filming it, I'd probably uh, stretch it out and, and, and use my fingers, but we can make this go a little bit quicker. Now here is, uh, oh, come out, it's stuck. Here we go now. And thank you for those who helped me last time, because I didn't know what to call these things. I was calling it like a pamphlet or papers and all these other stupid names but of course it's a checklist so thank you for all the people who let me know uh, that this is called a checklist oh there's also another name which good was good um i've forgotten <laughs> so, but some people said checklist and something else and both names were fitting so thank you for that and um since i've got this open so this is all the different bots we can find and back here are the pilots from the pilot packs the bot blasters you can get from the different packs and then the battle the battle uh, accessories you can get from the battle packs so I'll put that there now let's keep going it's uh, I'm a bit of a, a bit torn between going fast for those who have already seen me open a few of these or going slow just in case I've got someone who hasn't seen me open these so I'll try to go medium speed not too fast not too slow and hopefully we can still cover everything now there we go this is a uh, new one I already know I've got a new robot because I've never seen a kind of gold colored pack. We've found uh, black ones, like that over there, and we've got some silver ones. Like, I don't know if you can see the silver poking through, but there's little bits of silver. But this one is a gold one, which is cool. Now, uh, the first step, I'll let you have a closer look. Now, you see there, each one is numbered. So, part one, section two, section three, section four. So, we open them up in that order. Oh, I can already see something inside. Okay, so let us first, we'll separate it there like it says. And we've got a, it feels like a body part. So put that there, put that there. There we go. Okay, so this will tell me straight away if I go to new bot or a kind of a double up. But no, he's definitely a new guy. Now, some of you might already know who this is, but I don't, because uh, some of you might have seen him before. I'll put that there. Okay, now part number two. So how do we get this part opening opened? There's no instructions, so I'm just going to pull it. Ugh, there we go. Put that there, put that there. Okay, now this has got three parts in there. That's pretty big. That could be legs or a big weapon. Uh, I think that's the same as whatever that is. That's round. It's like a ball. Okay, I'm going to open this one first because I am the most intrigued by it. Okay, weird. It's, yeah, it's definitely a ball of some sort. I don't even know where to put that because it could be... It doesn't look like an arm or something, so I'll put it up on the shoulder there. There we go. And, oh, oh, while, while I've got you here, this just reminded me. Um, I've made a discovery recently, I'll use the joker for this, is that the parts, like the sockets here from the Ready to Robot set, are compatible with Mighty Micros or Mighty Minis. Yeah, Mighty Minis. Mighty Micros are the Lego ones. But so you can get like arms from the Joker or Superman and stuff, and they fit in there. 
There you go. So you could uh, put, the head won't work, but you can put arms and legs from the Mighty Mike, Mighty Minis into the ready to robot parts. So that's kind of cool. You can build like a ready to robot with like Superman's arms or Batman's legs or something like that. Or you can just attach like a bunch of heads or legs around the place. But uh, okay, we'll put that there. Now we've got these two to open up. Wow, it's huge. Okay, these are definitely legs. I was a bit bummed out last time because I got a uh, double up, so it's not as exciting as opening up a brand new guy like this. So it's cool. Okay, we got some wheels. Now I'm wondering if that's Remix. Like, I haven't looked, but I know Remix is pretty awesome. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. So I'm not going to look at the uh, checklist until we get right to the end and then we can see who it is. But I'm guessing it's Remix. But write in the comments below if you know who it really should be. Okay, and what have we got here? Three more bits, and then the pilot is next. So this, this will be the arms, and then another shoulder accessory. So this feels like an arm. We'll put that in there. And then another arm. Oh no, this is a shoulder bit. I wonder if I'm doing that right. It could go, oh, that looks like a laser of some sort. I don't know. I don't know which is the right, right way around. I'll take a guess and I'll put it like that. Okay, now the very last one. So this will be an arm and then we get to see the pilot in the slime. Okay, there we go. So that's the robot itself all assembled. So looking good. And now finally, actually let's uh, shoot at uh, Kook. I like to, no, Starsh, not Kook. Oh, even better. Oh, no, he, he won't fall down, but we'll, uh, how do we do it? So what I have to do next is push on this, uh, not kind of, kind of a little bit hard, and uh, what will happen is that little circle will sm kind of blast off and the slime should shoot out. And some of them, it shoots really far and really hard, and some not so far and hard. So we'll find out. Okay, three, two, one. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, I totally missed, but that did shoot pretty hard. Like it bounced off that uh, wall back there, you can't see. But it bounced off the back wall and kind of flung onto the floor somewhere. But uh, okay, so we'll put that back. Now we have our slime. So let's see if you can see who's inside. I see a face, someone with like a crazy kind of eye. Open up the slime, peel off the seal. And I found out, I don't, oh here we go. I found out that if you leave these out exposed to the air, that the slime kind of dries out and the slime becomes a little bit harder. See how that's not so slimy? And uh, also much smaller, so it kind of becomes hard like putty instead of like slime. I've got another one here too. Oh no, that's, that's a good one. But yeah, quite often, about twice already, I've left these out before putting them back in their container. And then the next day it's kind of harder and way, way smaller. So yeah, make sure you always put your slime back in your container else. The next day you'll find out you've lost half of it. Okay, now here we go. Now this is my favorite part, which is getting the pilot out. Okay, there we go. Now see if you can work out ah, who it is. Okay, focus. Ah, so slimy. Some of them <laughs> I, can, I can hold to the camera, but this one's just moving too much. Hey, he's gonna kind of break himself free. Uh, see his face? Nah. <laughs> Alright, I'll uh, put the slime away. Ah, oh, too sticky! Hold on, I need to get this off me. Some slimes seem to be more runny than others, and this is definitely a runny one. Ah, oh, look at that, gross! Get off. Okay, good enough. I still got uh, slimy hands, but I can live with that. Ah. Go away, go away, go away. <laughs> okay, now here we have the pilot. 
I don't know his name. Oh, awesome tattoo. He's got the word um, mum tattooed on the back of his head. He's got a cool pink mohawk. Now we'll put him into his uh, his robot and then we can check out who it is. So out of the way, put the lid on. Okay, so we'll put him there. Now let's check out the checklist. Okay, now who do you think it will be? Do you see him? Aha, I think I see him at the top. Mama's boy, his name is. So that's cool. Okay, and I did get the rockets around the right way as well. So that means it's going to be Mama's boy fighting against Stash from last week. So uh, let's start this battle and then uh, they can battle while I'm off washing my hands. Three, two, one. Are you ready, Mama's boy? I'm not going to sneak up to you like Killswitch did. Ah, oh, Stash, you'll never beat me. Whoa, that was close. Zorita! Now it's about time I finish this. No! Okay, now congratulations, Starch. It looks like you are once again the... Huh? Ha ha! I ran over here just before your rocket hit me and I borrowed an arm off Superman. And that's how I shielded myself. Hey, don't get too comfortable with that arm. I want that back when you're done with it. Now, congratulations, Mama's boy. I don't think uh, Stash is going to be making any kind of comeback soon. You got me fair and square. So uh, that makes you the winner of this one. Now stay tuned for next time because we're going to open up another mystery pack. We're going to find out what's inside this. Um, probably next week. I do one every week roughly at the moment. So uh, stay tuned. Um, if you want to make sure you don't miss out on it, make sure you subscribe. Because that way uh, you'll know when any future videos come out. And also, uh, I don't know, you can then never lose this channel amongst the billions of other channels. Um, like the video if you haven't liked it already. Leave a comment if you want to say anything. Tell me if you've got one of these already or who's your favorite one or just say hi. Whatever, I'm, I'm, I'm easy. I'll respond no matter what you say. Um, but until next time, guys, have a great week. Take care of yourself and I will catch you next time.